Hi, I'm El Shamahi and I f***ing love science. My latest series, Human Pieces Together, the latest scientific discoveries to reveal our origin story. And in places, it gets seriously weird. The archaeologists, using new and improved dating techniques, were able to give us dates for these fossils. And they tell us that these individuals lived about 300,000 years ago. And that is mind-boggling because we thought our species was only about 200,000 years old. What these fossils tell us is that our species, Homo sapiens, is 100,000 years older than we thought. We are a third older than we realised. This fossil went from being enigmatic and a, basically a mystery to being one of the most important fossils in our whole field. Thousands of miles from East Africa, where we thought we began, and far older than expected. These are the earliest Homo sapiens ever found. And they have forced us to rethink other finds across Africa. What? Just one? Um, <laughs> uh, finally got to see the uh, tiny humans, sometimes referred to as the hobbits, um, like after the Lord of the Rings. Uh, I got to finally see the actual real life um, hybrid of a Neanderthal and a Homo sapien um, in Romania. Uh, got to see one of the earliest um, human fossils ever in a museum in Ethiopia. Um, I mean, the, the list just goes on. Oh, and got to see one of the sites of the earliest ritual. So that's not one, that's loads, sorry. I am a Neanderthal specialist. However, Homo floresiensis, the hobbit of the Lord of the Rings fame, uh, is definitely kind of a, a side interest. I think people will come to realise that we should be a bit more humble and that we should also be more impressed at the same time with how spectacular our story is because we could have easily become extinct like the others. Um, we could have easily fallen by the wayside well before the others did um, because they were pretty impressive and much more impressive than us in so many ways when we first turned up on the scene. I think uh, they were absolutely incredible, the other species, and yet somehow we're the only ones left. I would love to know exactly how many human species were out there. I would love to know how they interacted with each other. Like, did they see each other as, oh, that's that's very, very different, those people over there? Or were they like quite chill with them? I would love to know a bit more about how we came to become so successful when the others didn't and how much we played a part in the demise of all those other species. Just some of the many, many questions about our origins that I kind of would love to know more about, but we may never ever have answers to those questions. It's, it's a bit like having a peek behind the curtain of evolution. This is a stage in the journey to becoming us.